Hi folks, Lee here and a warm welcome back to the channel for another Left 4 Dead video. Um, and for this episode I wanted to talk about another sort of political issue. Um, again, I'm not going to get into, you know, my thoughts and candidates or whatever or anything like that. That's not what this is for. Um, but what I wanted to talk about was the concept of universal basic income. Now... It's an idea that I've heard about, you know, getting talked about for quite a few years, and it's basically the idea that every citizen of a country um, should be paid a fixed sum of money each month, regardless of their income status, to basically keep them afloat. And the idea of this is born out of quite a few things, right? The number one kind of thing that has kind of got this idea going is the fact that in the future there's going to be a lot more automation and for a lot of people it's going to be much harder to find a job um, so it means that you've got all these big companies investing in you know technologies for drone deliveries and self-driving cars and all of this stuff it means that you know you can take some of those profits and essentially use them to fund a universal basic income so that you know ordinary people don't go completely broke because you know they're unemployed through what would essentially be no fault of their own at that point right so you know i've heard a few arguments for and against this uh, and i feel like it's probably gotten a little more popular with the current situation in the world um, now, what I would say of my own opinion on this is um, a little undecided because I feel that like there's arguments for and against that are both really good, if you know what I mean. Now, what I would say is the arguments for is basically, as I says, it's a safety net against increasing automation and increasing unemployment and I think that's great. And the other idea is, you know, it is something I've kind of dabbled in for a long time. It's the idea that, like, you know, like, we are the only species in the world that's, like, expected to work, if you know what I mean. Um, and we need to work to survive and kind of earn our place in the world, if you know what I mean. Uh, now... You know, I do think that idea is a little bit flawed, but um, at the same time, you know, I'll get back to that later. Now, the argument that I've saw, saw against it is basically the idea that, like, okay, so you're going to end up with all of these big companies running everything, and, you know, a universal basic income just sounds a bit too much like, you know, just a kind of basic handout to keep the peasants happy as you would say like you know it sounds a bit like that to some people um, and what I would say is I definitely get that argument um, now the other thing I would say in favour of it is you know and this is one of the points that's kind of used against it right now a lot of people would say well if you're getting a universal basic income then no one's going to want to work, right? And I would disagree with that because I feel like even if, like everyone wants a purpose, everyone everyone wants something to do, right? Like even if, you know, there was no work available, like I would still, you know, want to do something, do you know what I mean? I would still want to do something productive that made me feel like I've got some sort of purpose, you know? whether that was some sort of creative pursuit or whether it was even just doing this, do you know what I mean? Like, I'm doing this because, you know, I've got free time and I want to be productive with that free time, do you know what I mean? So, but, I mean, there's other things as well. Like, everyone would want to do something, right? And, you know, there's still going to be some jobs out there for a long time, right? So, like... This is going to happen eventually. Like eventually automation is going to happen and there's going to be less jobs available. So why don't we do this now so that people 
have the choice and it means that for employers that are out there just now they're going to actually need to work to you know make workplaces enjoyable places to work if you know what I mean as well heard that argument as well um, so overall yeah I'm pretty undecided uh, I'm kind of leaning towards being in favour of it but at the same time like I'm not completely there there yet if you know what I mean um, so I would love some comments down below I'd love some thoughts on the matter um, so you know get comment below uh, if you liked the video give it, give it a like if you hated the video give it a dislike um, and as I said if you've got any thoughts down below are you in favour of universal basic income um, are you against it you know which, which arguments do you find more convincing? Um, yeah, just put them in the comments down below. And as always, if you'd like to see some of this content in the future, then please do subscribe. Um, I always get a messy situation at the end of these videos. Um, but yeah, uh, so as I said, if you'd like to see more of this content in the future, then please do subscribe. Bye, folks.